According to the Roscoe Village Neighborhood Watch Committee, they've been helping businesses install surveillance cameras like this one. Because of an uptick in crime, they say they have less police officers patrolling their neighborhoods, so they wanted to come together and put together a network of cameras that could help police if a crime is committed. Now, they may have captured their first images of suspects. They hit on Saturday for the first time at 1230 at four trays and then again on Monday at 830 in the evening here at Commonwealth. That's when Alderman Scott Wagesback was dining inside the restaurant and said he saw the three suspects come in. That he says they were fidgety. One of them took a seat by the door at a table and two others started walking up and down the bar trying to steal people's wallets. When they came to one man at the front, he resisted and that's when other people in the restaurant stood up to help him. The thieves then left empty handed, ran out of the bar and Alderman Wagesbeck says they are believed that those same suspects hit at two other bars in the area, Miller's and Lush. Right now, Chicago police don't have anyone in custody, but they do have clear images of those suspects thanks to these cameras.